Here we have a 2008 Mini 1 three door hatchback in red with the contrasting black mirror caps. Looking at the offside front tyre, we're looking at about 3mm tops on the offside front tyre. Offside front alloy, you can see there is some light curbing around the outside edge of the alloy there. Looking around the rest of the condition, a little bit of paint bubbling. Apart from that, it doesn't look too bad, but a potential refurb required. Looking down the offside of the vehicle, there is one or two very light dinks. There's no sign of any dents at all down the offside there, though. Around the offside front arch, nice condition, nothing to really report there. Again, driver's mirror cap, a bit of a scratch on there, it's a little bit deep, so it may require a little bit of paint. Driver's door itself does look very clean, um, barely any sign of any scratches, etc. Just literally one or two very light marks here and there. Door edge again, just one or two very, very minor little nicks in there that may require some touchings. Not really needed, to be honest. Some scratches behind the door there, may need a polish. Apart from that though, it does look very clean. Rear arch is all in good condition. Rear tyre. Again, we're looking really at about 3-4 millimetres of tread. And the offside rear alloy, taking a good look at the condition. Once again, there's no signs of any curbing or scuff marks at all there. Even around to the rear side of the vehicle. Looking at the rear bumper, as you can see, got a bit of a paint blemish on at the rear quarter. A little bit hard to see. Um, looking on the loading bay of the vehicle, it's definitely required a good mop and polish here. There's quite a few light scratches going down the loading bay of the vehicle. Apart from that, like I said, no signs of any damage, all the boots in good condition, etc. And looking inside the boot of the vehicle, if we just open up the car. Right, we're having trouble uh, opening up the boot here. If I try and unlock it off the, bit, off the key, there we go. So it definitely locks off the key, but doesn't open from the actual lock here. So you can only open it off the key, so just be wary of that. Inside you've got your um, parcel shelf etc, obviously needs a bit of a clean, but no spare wheel with the Mini. We've around to your near side rear tyre, and there's easily a good 5mm of tread there. Looking at the near side rear alloy, as you can see there is a couple of light little curb marks around there. So again, potential refurb required, but not too bad. Hub cap is also worn. Looking at the near side of the vehicle, one or two light dinks, but again, no signs of any dents or any damage. Rear arch is all in nice condition. Rear door edge, again, there's just one or two light little scratches around that will just need a mop or polish. Apart from that, there's some light scratches on the mirror, so a good mop needed there. And again, moving around to the front arch, again, looks very clean and tidy. And the front tire, about 3-4 millimetres of tread. Near side front alloy, you can see there's a very light curb mark on the outside edge of the alloy there. Again, a bit of a curb mark at the bottom. And again, a bit of a scuff mark there. So, again, a potential refurb. Moving around to the front end of the vehicle now. No signs of any damage at all. Everything appears to be in good order. And again, it's just a couple of stone chips on the front end of the car and on the bonnet that are going to require some touchings. Looking on the windscreen, as you can see, you've got a very small sort of stone chip there in the window, so just be wary of that. And looking on the interior of the vehicle, as you can see, I've got the full cloth interior. There's some stains on the driver's seat as you can see, no damage at all though. And the back seats are very nice and clean, no damage at all there, no signs of any stains or marks. And the front passenger seat is also in a nice condition. As you can see, got the red colour line inside, nice condition, steering wheel is not looking too bad for its age, there's no scratches or marks. And stepping inside the car itself, we do only have one key with the vehicle, so just one key. You can see it's a little bit worn. Starting the vehicle up, as you can see there is a service light indicating there on the dash and also what appears to be a higher pressure warning light as well, so just be wary of those. 67,308 miles on the clock. Starting the radio, as we can see no issue there, CD player. Blows work perfectly fine, your air conditioning light indicates that it's on and off, all the windows work etc. Manual transmission on this one, taking a look at the documents, V5, the vehicle's had three owners, it does come with an MOT which expires May 25th 2016, so a good year's MOT, and just to top it off guys, it's a full mini service history, so you can see you've got 21, 22, 37, 45, not sure on that one there. And then we've got what appears to be 62. Um, so recently, it's been serviced not that long ago. 
but full mini service history as well, so that's spot on. There you go guys, it's the 2008 Mini 1, it is the petrol in red, and it's not a bad looking car at all for its age.